April snow survey of the season is happening this morning. Yeah, and Governor Newsom is scheduled to make a special guest appearance in the Sierra. Let's get right to KCR3's Mike Desell live in Strawberry Knot to explain why the Sierra snowpack is proving so newsworthy. Yeah, and I've got a special treat for you. We're standing at Strawberry Station. I'll just step out of the way and towering over the Strawberry Lodge. You can see the snow still clinging to the uh, cliffs of Lover's Leap here as there is still snow in these upper elevations of the Sierra. In fact, take a look because this is video from last month's snow survey. What was significant a month ago was that this snow survey pretty much symbolized a big turnaround after some big storms uh, turnaround from a slow start to the winter season to rebounding almost back to normal. And since then, we've seen even more uh, late winter snowstorms approaching springtime. So just how much has the snow season rebounded from the slow start? We'll take a look at the numbers and follow along with me because back on January 1st, the statewide Sierra snowpack was just 28% of average for that date, down 72%. And by February 1st, it was still lagging, only about half of where it should be on average. But now look at that number today. With so much snow in the past two months, the statewide Sierra snowpack rebounded all the way to above average, 110% of average for this date. Or put in simpler terms, we went from a really, really slow start to above average to close out the winter snow season and back out here live again uh, that beautiful picture of lovers leap if you're wondering why do we talk about the snow survey and why does it matter because the sierra snowpack is essentially our water supply for california come the later extended dry periods of uh, hot summer months in those early fall months so that's why it's significant and this one of the views Governor Newsom will see as he's driving up to the snow survey happening just up the road from here along Highway 50 in a couple hours from now. Live in the Sierra, Eldorado County, Mike Sell, KCRA 3 News. Mike, thanks so much. Seven